battle for Gondor begins. Now I'm going to save it because I have a feeling that something's going to happen if I don't. Okay. Northern Isidium is a dense wooded land of Gondor, now ruled by Sauron. A valiant few still patrol this region, hoping to one day reclaim it for Gondor. And don't worry, we will. The hobbits find an unfriendly welcome. There they find the Forbidden Pool. So small things, but it's so beautiful. There are reports of more lumber mills to the east. They're clearing away the trees, and with them, our cover. We must take out the lumber mill, or else we'll soon be battling on a barren plain. Call up more men from the Forbidden Pool. What do you get from the Forbidden Pool, you ask? You get more rangers. That's actually all you need. You need nothing else but rangers and fillion. Sam, I want you to at least level up to level 5. It would be disappointing if you didn't. And I'm going to get the Beacon of Gondor. Please tell me I can actually use it. Good. Oh, Frodo, please don't die yet. <laughs> don't die too early. <laughs> that was a bit too close. Let him destroy that Lumber Mill, though. That'll give him some good experience. Prime is already level 2. Good. Good. You beast! Let us scout for Gondor. So instead of elven fleshings, we have steel tipped arrows. Yeah! Spires of the enemy! Oh, yeah, Rim. Rangers of the Fillion also don't get fire arrows. They get the same ability that uh, the elves did, except a slightly weaker version. They don't get as much range. But to be fair, I think they have more base range, so, you know, it, it kind of counts out. Elves and rangers are technically meant to be the same kind of units, except the elves can get armor and all that, while they can't. I, I, I don't get it sometimes. So. But, the, the, yeah, the rangers, I think, are just are better in general. Also, look at the detail on these guys. Look at the details. It's the small things I, I, I prefer to look at. Go lightly. Come on, Sam. You've almost got another level. And that's for my old gaffer. I don't think so. Can now start getting steel tipped arrows, unfortunately. Oh no, the 400. Okay, that's fine then. I thought they were going to be 800 like they used to be with fire arrows. Okay, we need to contact the rangers in the south, get the trebuchet, etc, etc. You know the drill. If you've played this uh, campaign before. Keep Frodo and Sam safe, just out of the way for now. I want six units of rangers with me. And I can get them all fully upgraded. No, we can't go that way. That way is a dangerous place. I also like how the Haradrim are no longer um, throwing giant spears. They're now throwing... They're now shooting bows. You know, the way they should be. Drag them down. Guard this area. Now we can't summon upon the elves or the Rohirrim here. Now, nor, neither can we trap. But we can get the guards of the White Tree, and they're a good unit. They're the elite unit you can only make one of as Gondor from the fortress. Which I do intend to do, because they are a very good unit. And when they level up enough, they give heroes extra benefits. Mm -hmm. 
Stay back and let Prime Mater with us alone. I want to get some more experience. Um, are you coming for me? You looking at me? You looking at me? They're bringing more orcs and out of light. And now that's wounding out of that Muma kill. It's a shame I can't kill the Muma kill and make it go on fire to kill all those Haradrim. But unfortunately, the game doesn't work that way anymore. They've changed that in many recent patches. Fire arrows used to send them on fire and then make them rampage. Then they made it so fire arrows didn't do that. Just because, you know, Mordor Muma kill actually a bit weak when they couldn't use fire when they were just taken over by fire and then they've been restricted to only four Muma kill but still look at the detail on this big boy doesn't it doesn't the pupil alone the way it blinks it's such a small thing but it's so nice to have a look at from time to time and even this, this random Haradrim guy, that doesn't do exist for anything else other than to be for this one mission. He's got some good detail on him too. No, sorry, I'm, I don't think I'll be dying today. That was easy enough. Frodo, Sam, I want you to go over here and make contact with those rangers for me. While Faramir and his company continue to wreak havoc. Aim at the neck. I mean, that trebuchet we want to get rid of these buildings fast. Because we can't do any damage to them without fire arrows, unfortunately. Be calm. Be calm. Let's pray they don't make any Muma kill. That would be a problem. Wretched creatures. And you two just stay cloaked, please. Keep out of sight and danger at all times. Rid us of this disgusting place. I think it will. I, we can't make it rampage, you see. Oh, and all those have now been triggered. Let's just cloud break for a second. There you go, that'll do. That'll do. And I can shoot those Haradrim from great range. Come on, Trebuchet, you've almost done your job. You've almost done the one job I've asked you to do. Yeah, Frodo and Sam must survive. Yeah, Frodo must survive. Sam's not important. <laughs> Sam's not important enough. But he just wants to help. Keeps him heal off cooldown. My reason's on my own. What did I do? <laughs> Make ready the trebuchet. Okay, 
Oh, is that Mumek Pen? Wow, they've got some very long re leash ranges nowadays. Oh, they're just moving into position. Yeah, they're just moving into position. That's fine. Don't let them get a Mumek kill from that pen. Do not let that happen. Getting any more rangers? Well, yes, but obviously can't get one yet. That's the one problem not having fire arrows. You do zero damage to buildings. We must destroy this Okay, Frodo, Sam, get rid of those buildings for me. That trebuchet will just help get rid of those tents. Give you something to do while you're just sitting doing nothing. Get two more units of rangers. Move up this way. Okay, Trebuchet get into position. Excellent. Shoot them down quickly. Let's not waste any time on these fools. Do not let them head down Trebuchet. It is imperative it survives. If you want to actually destroy this fortress, we might want that Trebuchet left alive. Well done, Frodo and Sam. Let's not let them build anything up. Throw down the beacon of Gondor. Not everything in that beacon is going to have 50% extra armor. And enemy leadership is negated. Trammy, you just keep shooting that. Everyone else, focus the barracks before it gets built. It's only a monster. Shoot a bit of everything just to bring everything down quicker. Get Frodo and Sam in here to defend them. So far from home. And now let's build that camp. Got five thousand. Good. Now let's prepare for the ambush. And you need two over here. Two over here. And two over here. Frodo and Sam should stay here. And the trebuchet will stand here. Now then, let's get a barracks. Some blacksmiths. And a stables. Don't worry, I've got a plan. I've got a plan. Don't get that, actually. Because Gondor's had a few improvements over the uh, vanilla experience. Keep it up, keep it up. Put the guys in between. Yep, set up camp. 
convoy arrives in three and a half minutes. And yet we can also get Knights of Dolamroth, which I want to get. Limited to only three. And we can also get guards, uh, guards of the Citadel. Or Citadel Guards, whatever your preference. Bunch of spearmen. And then once a blacksmith levels up, we'll get the upgrades and we'll start upgrading everyone. Yeah, that bonus damage to cavalry doesn't actually help against Moomer Kill. They're just like ends, they just trample everything. There's no point using that ability. There's a point to the banner carriers. Knights are expensive, but they'll be worth it soon. Wait, only two was enough to upgrade it? Oh, that's better than I thought it would be. Be on guard! Be on guard. And yeah, that only lasts as long as the cooldown of the beacon, sadly. Ready. One minute left. They're further beacon down here once the convoy arrives. So I imagine half of those units are going to want to destroy the rangers. In fact, let's put a few of them up here just to prevent any evil men from getting up there. I'm not going to be able to get the upgrades in time. That's a shame. That's fine, though. We can live with that. The Haradrim are coming. Hurry, soldiers. The Haradrim are coming. Here they are. And yep, there's their camp. Let's get with that Mumak pen. Yep, throw down the beacon. Use the fear so they can't fight back. Let's see if my theory about this is correct. Oh yeah, I forgot. We can get these guys. Yeah, Mumikil do not care. Oh no! Oh! Oh, that did something! I think. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I've not got enough information to find out. But it, it, it does seem that the, this porcupine formation does prevent them from actually trampling these guys. But yeah, they're not the source of the damage. Of when, when they get trampled. Or would be trampled. Oh, soldiers of rune. Wow, we didn't, lose, we didn't lose a single unit of rangers. Honestly, I'm impressed. I'm impressed in my efficiency in that battle. Okay, rangers. Need to return back to base. Of all speed. It's the cave troll. I was an ordinary troll, I don't know the difference anymore. They're all the same. It's a different name. Oh, hello, Haradrim. Oh no, 
you don't. You're not killing off any of my units. Now below goes one more unit of rangers. Well, better replace it. I don't really need to. I feel like I should. Actually, no, let's not. Let's minimize down to eight units. And then let's try and get the Knight of Dolamroth. Close in! Yeah, no, they still died to his sweeping tusks, though, so that's a problem. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You are bloody lucky, Rangers. You are bloody lucky. That would have been half your army, that would have been half of your guys dead there. If I had not been prepared for that. Nice going in, try and get rid of that, please. Trebuchet, you can go back. I've got another plan for you. I'm going to get all these guards in the Citadel. We get five in total. Okay, let's try going around this way instead. Yeah, these guards in the Citadel, they're tough as nails. You will not see these fall back from battle. Anytime soon. Knights. Force it down. Well, we 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 scratched the moment pen, so we kind of did what I wanted to do. In Gondor's honor. Yeah, well, let's let's fall back for Gondor, shall we? Come on, that one ranger will survive. No, he didn't. Ouch. Knights of Minas Tirith. That was another moment kill. It's an opportunity to get rid of that. But it's tier 3, let's get the Knights of Dol Amroth. Wow, there's, an there's another little scratch. It's okay, we've almost got our full elite army, so I'm happy. In fact, can I get a full elite army? I might need to sacrifice another unit of rangers at this rate. If so, then so be it. Also, the trebuchet will have to go too. That tower first, it's annoying me. Men of Dol Amroth. Right, yeah, we need to get rid of another unit of rangers at some point. To get the full elite army up. Guess the golden opportunity I wanted. Trebuchet in place, almost good. Just 
looking to lose a little more. Just one more, just one more ranger. Not a whole battalion, just a whole, just a whole one ranger. I can get the last nut for Amroth. There. I just realised I got all those I bought all those upgrades from the uh, the blacksmiths. All I need is the banner carriers. Oh, uh, I'm silly sometimes. I'm a little bit silly sometimes. Lancers. Bring everything in now. Go full ham. We can do it. Lancers. Just need these banner carriers, and then after that, GG. I've won. I love these beautiful knights in combat. Lances. We almost lost a unit of Dolanroth Knights. That is inexcusable. I cannot let that happen. No, I'm this close to ending it. There we go. Victory is ours. And that is, it will be the end for today. There is still hope. There is still hope. Victory! We have victory! And another great victory. Everyone leveled up one. Got a bunch of units leveled up two. 16 in total. And that will comprise our new army. Well, only four units of affiliate rangers, but three Dolanroth knights, one guard of the, Cit of the white tree, and five, five, uh, <laughs> five guards of the citadel. Primary reach level three and killed 93. Not bad, not bad at all. Northern affiliate defended. Sauron wages war in all Middle Earth. He must be stopped, or all shall fall into the dark. Well, next time, we'll be playing through all the way to the defense of Minas Tirith, I think. I think we can get that far. We'll take two settlements over, defend Oskiliath, def uh, take down Shelob's Lair.